Wolf. Boat ready? Yes. Bazima in revolt awaits. Cut the rhetoric and grab the oars. Sire, victory. Despite heavy losses, we now control the trade quarter. Excellent. What news from De Wet? He's dead. Cut down by that godless butcher, the Witcher. Useless De Wet. Have the town criers informed the people Adder has become a Strigger? Yes, but the Witcher found the beast. Geralt of Rivia. Only he stands between me and... We must fan the flames of chaos. Release more of our experiments, and let the Elves wreak havoc. Grandmaster, I must protest, as a nobleman and representative of... Enough. Give the people more food, and tell them any God-fearing human can find shelter at the castle of the Order of the Flaming Rose. Adalbert, I thank you for your loyal service. Take him away. A new era dawns. An era of superhumans. None will stop me. I appoint you my new adjutant. Know your assignment? Kill the Witcher. Then go. Geralt, you've arrived at a moment that should be called nothing short of historic. Dandelion, I'm glad you're alive too, but I have important matters. More important than a Temerian redaining alliance with far-reaching consequences? Stop being dramatic and tell me what's happening. All right, let me tell you quickly before Yavin's arrested. He won't be as long as I'm here. The King will be forced to acknowledge me as a temporary ally. You sure? Foltest already has an ally in Radovid of Redania. I'm certain. Humans live brief lives like mayflies. They're not likely to surprise me. Whether King or Poet, no offense, Dandelion. We can't pass through the city without the King's consent. You're still a wanted elf. Then let us speak to your King. We must hurry. Ah, serving a crown. Welcome, Witcher. Sire. We have several things to discuss. Of course. Stop deliberating, son. We need to put out the fire in this whorehouse. You'll get the princess's hand, and if life has taught me anything, half the kingdom as soon as I'm gone. As for de Aldersburg, we need to be rid of him. The Witcher will slay him. What? Relax, we'll pay you as much as you want. I'm a Witcher, not a hit. All right, 10,000. Isn't that a bit much? Come on, Foltest, the kingdom's worth a lot more than that. Yes, I suppose the boy's right. But you shall take home 8,000. It's a deal. So, we're all agreed. Radovid, your armies must subdue the Order in Redania and in the north of my lands. My armies will embark on a mission of fraternal assistance. I don't want any fucking fraternal assistance. The phrase rubs me the wrong way. You are to smash the Knights of the Order and withdraw. Relax, Foltest. My children will rule this land. I don't intend to destroy it. <clears throat> Forgive me, Your Majesties, but I feel it's time I... One more thing, Witcher. Yes? So, let's talk politics. And don't you dare mention neutrality. Judging by your company, you're already involved. Possibly up to your nose. Sire, your wish is my command. To the average pleb in the street, the Order is fighting my armies. But make no mistake. This is a confrontation between me and the Grand Master. That ambitious fanatic directed all of Salamandra's actions and intentionally provoked the uprising. What do you mean? I thought you'd be interested, sire. Very interested, and that means the Order is the enemy, is that clear? As day. The Order is the enemy, not the Scoia'tael. You're getting it, but only if those long-eared bastards stop burning my city and slaying my merchants. Did you hear that, Yavin? And if those long-eared bastards cease, can they then, as fighters for freedom and decency, count on the King's clemency? Or even amnesty? Only those that lay down their arms, and not all can be forgiven. 
the people would not understand. Yavin, you must disappear. Go away somewhere far. I shall restrain my officers from hunting you for a few days. You'll restrain them longer and instruct them not to look hard. In gratitude, for we'll rid you of Jacques de Aldersberg. Sire, one other matter. Witcher? How is Ada feeling? Much better than she was as a strigger, yet she won't be herself again for some time. Witcher, how can I thank you? I'm glad Ada is alive and well. Can you ensure that the Witcher's friends will be the same, sire? Yes, that's something I can promise. Witcher, I wish to know who was behind all this. DeWet transformed the princess. How so? He was acting on behalf of the Order. The bastard! If I could get my hands on him! Those responsible assumed your position would be undermined if the princess wreaked havoc as a strigger. DeWet has been punished. I'm glad to hear it. Now go. Vizima is burning, fighting rages. You won't have an easy time of it. People see witchers as monster slayers. Rightly so. Few know we draw greater satisfaction from removing a curse or a spell. Swords are a final resort. As long as there was a chance I could save the princess, I had to try. It was worth it. I'm surrounded by imbeciles. Tamaria is a mess. This is no time to talk. We must hurry. We must act. Ah, serving the crown. Then Bold Foltest uttered these words. Virtuous Radovid. What the hell is that? I'm trying to keep a faithful and accurate record of these events. He said, stop deliberating, son. We need to put out the fire in this whorehouse. Geralt, you have no sense of poetry. There's the truth of time and the truth of legend. You'll never change. The pen is mightier than the sword. And you'll never change either. Off to save the world again when nobody's asked. I understand. What a day. You were wrong to cross me. You're the one who's wrong. Stop barking, wolf, and draw your sword. Do you enjoy working for a madman? Do you murder for pleasure or simply to follow orders? I need not listen to you. You're not even human! Under their shining armor, it's all... As I knew from the start, you saw as a... Come on, Yavin. Let's cut off this... Come inside! You're right. The squirrels and the order. Those dry ones disturb our swamp. Between a rock and a hard place, huh? I had a dream, white-haired one. 
Your destiny will be fulfilled. I come to tell you. Mistake not the stars with their reflection in a pond's surface. I'll remember that. Greetings. Others stricken by war have sought... We won't stay long. We need to... So you're among those who have chosen to trust the eternal fire? Hmm. There's no sense in going out in the street again. You'll perish. Is there another route? Try the door in the cellar. Where does it lead? To other cellars. And an exit, eventually, I assume. But I cannot guarantee it is safe. We'll risk it. The key should be somewhere in this house. You on an important mission for the king. Praiseworthy. I too wish to offer Foltus my services as an advisor in these difficult times. Sadly, I could not get through burning Vizima. I need to get to the monastery. I have learned much about a phenomenon of interest to you. The Wild Hunt. Tell me. In folk culture, the king of the Wild Hunt embodies death. He is the one who takes away souls. He is oft considered as the tool of destiny. Destiny. The Wild Hunt is an omen of war and tragedy. It has oft been seen recently near Vizima. Beware. I must go. Farewell. Everything will dry. It's unavoidable. Gre Greetings. I'm afraid. The time for contempt has come, just as prophesied. What do you have in mind? No Ithleen's prophecy. Not exactly. The war with Nilfgaard proved it. For Ithleen foretold the blood of Ensaid, of elves, would drench the land. People thought the age of the sword and axe, the age of the wolf's blizzard, had arrived. Know the rest? Not sure. Then listen. The time of white frost and white light approaches. The time of madness and disdain. Ted Dayred, the end of ages. The world will perish in frost. Enough pessimism. The prophecy has now begun. Depends on us. Farewell. May Melitele protect you. I don't care about prophecies. I care about the lives of ordinary people. I know you care about people. I saw calm and happy with the captain of the guards. You know they got married? Nice to hear. Thanks to you, Witcher. I heard you cast a spell on Vincent. That poor girl deserved a little happiness. Poor girl? Carmen endured a lot. She lived in the outskirts. Her father was a priest of the Eternal Fire, a damnable man of religion. When Carmen got pregnant, he cast her out. She went to Vizima. You know how that ended. I didn't know. Gre Greetings. I'm afraid. I don't care about prophecies. I care about- I know you care about people. Nice to hear- Thanks, poor Car When Carmen- I Gre Prospering Dwarf? War can be profitable. If not for the king's taxes, the plague take them. How did you get here? Don't you see? Knights, soldiers, and Skyatel run through the streets, cutting down who they can. I am a traitor to all of them. I see. And all their heads are filled with prophecies, destinies, strange signs, and other nonsense. No one to talk to. Sorry to hear that, but I need to go. Farewell. Watch out for yourself, Witcher. Julian left for Kovir. Witcher! I see war is to your liking, Vitala. 